Connect your interface to your computer via USB, Firewire or Thunderbolt. Make sure it's plugged in if it needs to be and turned on. Install any software drivers associated with your interface before starting Pro Tools. Once it's all installed and switched on, go to Finder, Applications, Utilities, Audio MIDI Setup and you'll see your interface listed in the left side column, with the available inputs and outputs in the right column. If you go into System Preferences Sound, you should see your interface available to select as input and output for your computer. Select your interface as the input, since you're using it to input audio, and select it as your output if you're using it to run headphones or monitors so you can hear the audio in your session. Open Pro Tools and open your session. Go to Setup Playback Engine and make sure your interface is selected from the menu. Your session might have to close and reopen if you need to change the playback engine, that's okay. When the session reopens, navigate to Setup Hardware and make sure your interface is listed and selected. Now if you go back into the playback engine window, you'll see your interface selected there. Now your interface should be controlling all audio input and output to and from Pro Tools. Now when you navigate to your channel strip and select input, you should see your available inputs under the interface menu and outputs under the outputs menu. Your interface is ready to use. <laughs>